combines the sum of the roots of this equation first we look at the binomial expansion a quarter minus x all to the power of 2000 and 24. By the binomial theorem we know that x plus y all to the power of n equals sigma from k equals zero to n n choose k x to the power of n minus k y to the power of k where n choose k equals n factorial over k factorial times n minus k factorial by applying the binomial theorem we can now write equals minus x all to the power of 2024. The coefficients is 1 as k equals 0. So n choose k equals n choose 0, which is 1 plus 2024 over 4 times minus x all to the power of 2023. Here, k equals 1, so n choose k equals n choose 1, which is 2024. x to the power of n minus k times y to the power of k is minus x all to the power of 2,023 times a quarter plus so on plus a quarter all to the power of 2,024 minus x all to the power of 2,024 is equal to x to the power of 2,000 and 24 minus x all to the power of 2,000 and 23 is equal to minus x to the power of 2,000 and 23. So the left hand side of the given equation is equal to 2 x to the power of 2,000 and 24 minus 506 x to the power of 2,023 plus so on plus a quarter to the power of 2,024. So the given equation can be written as 2 x to the power of 2,024 minus 506 x to the power of 2,023 plus so on plus a quarter to the power of 2,024 equals zero. Equation one is a polynomial equation of degree 2,024. So, equation 1 has 2,024 roots. We want to find the sum of these roots. The SS formulas, a polynomial equation of degree m has n roots, r1, r2, so on, rn, the sum of these roots equals minus a n minus 1 over a n. So by the SS formulas, we can now write equals minus a 2000 and 23 over a 2000 and 24, which is equal to 506 over 2, which is 253.
thus the sum of the roots of the equation is two hundred and fifty three.